Oh, good afternoon, August uh, something or other, 2020. I have no idea what the date is, 19th, something like that. Uh, it's a Wednesday, anyway. Let's give you a quick update on where we're at. As you know, the flooring's down. A good lady yesterday carpet lined the wheel arches and they look lovely that stuff is so easy to use and it just gives great finish even though that will be in a cupboard but it just finishes off nicely so we got the rear section side panels up so just about ready for stand construction on the beds as I said in a previous working from rear to front um, the beds will finish about three quarters of the way along the wheel arch and then the kitchen area this panel is cut but not fixed so obviously it's not in position I've just got it squished in there once I get it and it'll fit better but obviously not screwed that in because I want to carpet line all this bare metal that we're not going to be able to do with anything else. Um, a quick shout out to the restoration couple who give us a great tip. Once you put the uh, bubble foil over it using a foam over the top of it. It'll stop the sound you get from the foil and it'll help the carpet lining just to uh, look that bit smoother. Obviously we'll take the trims off, it'll be down underneath there and then the trims will go back on. Um, like I said, have a look at the restoration couple. Um, he's got an absolute brilliant video on what he did uh, with the carpet lining and some uh, foam, and it looked amazing. We're gonna do the same on the rear, but this is gonna be a sort of a very small garage area, but that'll get done later on. Not too worried about that. So that's where we're at. Um, We've got the funding now to uh, order the windows, one for there, one for the side loading door. We decided we're going to put two small uh, opening windows with fly nets or fly mesh in the sort of kids area, one on either side. Um, 700 by 500 skylights in the rear section so when me and the good lady are in bed we can uh, do a bit of star watching should the conditions allow um, and I need to put a roof vent in around about this position um, round about in the, in the kitchen area in the walkway um, with a fan so we can bring air in and take air out um, which will give us a good amount of ventilation so that's where we're at i got to order some more bits and uh, so the van will start filling up with the bits we got to fit so <laughs> I'm going to try and fit them as quick as they arrive and uh, yeah I'm really pleased with the progress and uh, Happy always taking shape. So catch you guys later. Bye.